What are the actual benefits of the kettlebell swing? Tune into this video to find out. And if you're looking for more awesome ways to simplify the process of getting healthy, make sure you subscribe to the channel, you tap that like button, and you click that bell to be notified when we release new videos. With that being said, let's get into it. What's going on everybody, Skylar Deem here, lifestyle fat loss coach, and today we are diving into the kettlebell swing. Now I released a video a while back with the kettlebell swing that blew up, and from what I can tell, a lot of people are very, very interested in why someone should do swings, what are the benefits of swings, and of course, how to do them. So in this video, I wanna cover six benefits that you can expect to see by doing consistent kettlebell swings. So with that being said, let's dive into it. First benefit of consistently swinging a kettlebell is that it builds full body power and strength. Now, if you think about this, if you're swinging this heavy weight, you're doing it over and over, it's going to develop some sort of power and strength. But the question is, how much? So there was a study posted in the journal of strength and conditioning research that wanted to test the transference of kettlebell strength to actual strength, power, and endurance. And so in this study, participants were tested, they did swings, and then they were tested again over a period of time. And what they found was that there was an increase in their clean and jerk, and there was an increase in their bench press. And so through that study, the results found that kettlebell training can be effective as an alternative method to enhance strength and power during traditional weightlifting exercises. Along with that, there was a study done by ACE, which we'll discuss in a little bit, that found that core strength while doing the kettlebell swing increased by 70%, which is a massive, massive jump. That's one side of the coin, right? If you're swinging this heavy thing around, you're probably gonna develop some sort of explosive power and strength. The other side, which is benefit number two of the kettlebell swing, is that the swing itself improves your cardio. Now, if you think about it, you're swinging it, which is the power, but you're doing it consistently for 30 seconds, 45 seconds, however long, and so you are gonna develop some form of cardiovascular strength. And so there's an ACE study done that found that through swinging for about a 20 minute workout, the average participant burned approximately 20 calories per minute. Now, if you wanna compare that to another exercise, that's about the same as running a six minute mile pace or even cross country skiing uphill at a fast pace. So if you look at that, that is an astounding result just from swinging a kettlebell, because first of all, most people can't run a six minute mile. Most people can't even run a 10 minute mile. But then second of all, in case anyone has any knee issues or joint issues, kettlebell swings help you avoid that where running, you're kind of beating your body down. So whether you are in incredible shape or you are a complete beginner, if you find the right weight with the kettlebell and swing, you can get some of the same cardio benefits from the kettlebell swing. And so that kind of segues into benefit three from the kettlebell swing, which is basically helping with weight loss. And so we can look at it from a calorie end, is it's gonna be much more effective at burning calories than a lot of other exercises. We can also look at it from a hormonal end where the kettlebell swing has been shown to have some pretty intense human growth hormone and testosterone changes. And so there's another study published in the Journal of Strength and Conditioning that also found that testosterone was significantly higher after doing kettlebell swings and growth hormone was higher as well. And so when we look at this from a holistic lens, not only do you have the added calories burned that's gonna aid with weight loss if you don't overeat, but you also have that hormonal changes that's gonna allow you to build more muscle, which in turn will help you burn more calories as well. So before moving into number four, I'm curious if you could leave me a comment, what weight do you usually swing with with the kettlebell? Right now I'm working with about 70 pounds, but that's been a pretty big transition because when I started out, I was probably at like 35 pounds, but I'd love if you could let me know in the comments. Benefit number four from the kettlebell swing is that it's going to strengthen your posterior chain and improve your general posture. And so there's another study done in the Journal of Strength and Conditioning that took seven male subjects and basically had them on a kettlebell swing regimen. What they found was that the seven participants actually had a very noticeable change in terms of the health of their back and the function of their back as well. It is worth noting that there were some people who found that it irritated the tissue in the back, but what I will say is that if you don't have your form right with the kettlebell swing, that's one of the risks you run. You really have to make sure that your form's dialed in. But either way, if you think about it, if you're swinging, you're exploding up at the top, that posterior chain is going to make a pretty big difference. And I also think it's worth mentioning that one of the benefits I saw when I did 200 kettlebell swings every day for a month was a strengthened posterior chain. And if you're interested in watching that video, you can check in the link of the description as well. Benefit number five of the kettlebell swing is that it improves overall balance. And so if you think about this from a logical standpoint, if you're swinging this kettlebell, it's this large mass that's moving back and forth. It is going to take some balance with your feet to be able to maintain that posture and to stay in that grounded position. And the science backs it up. Ace Fitness found that in addition to the predictable strength gains, kettlebell training was also shown to markedly increase aerobic capacity, which we talked about, improve dynamic balance, and dramatically increase core strength. And the final segue into benefit number six of the kettlebell swing, which was also shown in that same study I just mentioned, was increased heart health. And we can think about this from cardio endurance. We can think about this from improving the posterior chain, but basically being able to swing like that is going to improve the health of your heart. Of course, swinging with a heavy kettlebell is gonna improve your grip, as I saw with my experience 
experience. And there's a lot of other stuff out there, but as far as functionality of the kettlebell swing, as far as the benefits of the kettlebell swing, it's one of my favorite for overall fat loss, for overall metabolism. And it's something I believe most people should include in their weekly and potentially even daily routine. So that's all I got for you today, guys. Again, if you are interested in simplifying the process of weight loss, maybe you are sick of counting calories, maybe you're sick of bouncing from diet to diet or doing the yo-yo, and you really are focused on that sustainable path to weight loss, check the link in the description of this video. We've got a free training I put together on basically how we do what we do. And once you watch that, you're really gonna understand why what we teach is so effective. So with that being said, again, leave me a comment below with the weight that you usually swing with with the kettlebell. But besides that, as a reminder, subscribe to the channel, tap that like button, and also hit that bell to be notified when we release new videos. And of course, as always, make sure to eat smart, move more, sleep deep, and be grateful for this moment. I'll see you in the next video.